I'll do it. Or I can do it, either way. <laughs> do it! You wanna do it together, Will? Sure. Teamwork. Once upon a time in a magical land. No. <laughs> oh no, I clicked the link. Oh, the tracks and free. Alright. So, last time on Wacky Fun Adventures, um... Wacky Fun Adventures. We... We got a we, we got a healer. Yeah. Wait. <laughs> Shut up. No, we got a healer. Yay. Iron Bite, uh, Iron Bite, you did a good job for what you did, but you played a druid when we need a healer, you dick. <laughs> I will say this. At least we killed the and we the killed the clown. who apparently turned out to be not as big of a deal as we thought it would be. <laughs> Admittedly, I was kind of spamming an 8th level AoE, so... A little bit. Yeah. And I managed to land a critical hook while swinging blind. So, to be fair, we were kind of bringing a lot of firepower to a fight that only needed a little bit. <laughs> yeah, we completely overestimated that fight. So, um... <laughs> Which is not necessarily a bad thing. Yeah, it's better than what we did with Mira. Oh god. Yeah. <laughs> we can we just totally not take about, her. Can we just oh, really not talk about Mira anymore, please? You know she's <laughs> gonna be the next assassin, right? Toilet. You know please, that. Please stop jinxing it! Stop talking and giving Matthew Dealer ideas! Oh, he already okay. has all the ideas he needs. I know, but you don't need to give him more. Um, but, uh... I have a contingency uh, plan for dealing with Mira. But anyway, um, so at first this is Wannings, we went to go investigate the ancestral place of douchebag alchemists. Um, Found out the origin story of Bronin. And a, who apparently was a Trojan horse. Um... And also, apparently, like, we, like, found the journal of some dude who went, like, absolutely apeshit insane and carried, like, a suit of his own skin and then, like, ate people. On his own. Yeah. Anyways, so, and we found the magical toilet of ultimate destiny. <laughs> that turned out to be much bigger of a problem than, like, you know, it was really supposed to be. <laughs> I love how Magic Dealer creates these really simple traps for us. <laughs> yeah, that's just how it is! That's how it always is that I found it. That players make a big fucking thing out of th something that the DM thinks is going to be so fucking minuscule it's barely going to pass the time and we spend 30 minutes on it instead. Yeah. And don't forget, we almost lost her. <laughs> we almost lost Furthus. <laughs> Actually, you were closer to losing me than Furthus. The one that was fine. The one we almost <laughs> lost was the other two. <laughs> yeah, but you have no health. I mean, that's I, the truth. Great traps are simple ones. I mean, actually, my my only thing was I still think that we should have had to roll the hit against those things against our armor class. <laughs> actually, um, certain uh certain spike traps do you do have to roll to hit. So Not this one. Not this one, though. No, these ones were kind of falling at his, like, you know, terminal velocities, so you kind of really didn't have a choice to hit the spikes. Yeah, that, so, this one, this plus these are apparently douchebag number alchemists who's just like, oh, let's, tell me, let's see how many spikes we can get per square surface it is. I'm, I need to think of my words. Hold on. How per square spikes? inch. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. I'm mean, uh, here you to help. Now? Can I pull out the CR20s yet? No. Maybe one CR20, but we'll probably die. <laughs> no. I mean, the mirror thing didn't go that well, and apparently... I think was probably like a CR17. I feel like we really just bombed that encounter. <laughs> I feel like we really should No, 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 no. <laughs> we are the ones that got bombed on that encounter. We I think just I'm the one that got bombed in that encounter. I thought it was brilliant myself. I, oh, yeah. I really liked it because Magic Dealer didn't expect something like that. I think... I'm actually pretty sure I'm the one that got bombed in that encounter. <laughs> yeah, and then a little while later, I got fucked in an encounter. To be fair, the first, like, seven encounters, I almost died. Yeah. And you had to do it twice. Yeah, I've, I've had to have some form of resurrection on me twice. Ditto, actually. <laughs> Yeah, but you've been in this campaign for a little longer than me. I know, but I've only died since you've shown up. <laughs> Technically, Trueblags died twice, too. No, he hasn't. 
Yeah, Once. he did. Yeah, technically, yeah, he has died twice. What? Then he came back and died again. Do you remember the silencing ah. needles? Oh, I don't fucking count oh, that. Oh, yeah, those needles. That yeah. was, that was, that was just... By the way, Master Feeler, dick move. Dick move. <laughs> <laughs> just so uh, you're... I liked it, though. It was, it was He's fun just trying to me. burn through the wizard's pocket money. That's what's happening. No, if I wanted to burn through the wizard's pocket money, I'd use a fire-based spell. <laughs> uh... Speaking of which... Uh, no, lapse, please load. Just fuck off. What do you guys think the chances are of getting a hundred and ten thousand experience this uh, game? Very, Not very high. Very I just need eight, uh, eighty, uh, eighty-five thousand. You guys are like level sixteen, right? Uh huh. Yeah. yeah. Okay, then this guy is definitely too weak. Well, except Jix, and I think True Black is only fifteen still. Yep. Still, that that's like trivial for you guys. Why do people out of bed? The tier lapse always has an update on Wednesdays. I swear. Oh, this one looks good. But just saying, but Jix, you're like level twelve, aren't you? Yeah. That's that's one for Ooh, this, this could be no. I don't know. True bag, true bag being level fifteen doesn't scare me that much. You being level twelve kind of does. Uh, but it's a witch run by Tom, so yeah, it's not gonna be that big of a problem. <laughs> ah, just the HP value. How many? Hit yeah, points that's honestly that? what I'm worried about too. Just like, oh, I fucked up, got hit for two hundred damage, died. Yeah. I got one shotted. I don't know how much HP do you have? Me? Yeah. Eighty-five. Dude, I have 86! Fuck you! Wow. Winner! <laughs> okay, here's the real challenge. What's your AC? Uh, yeah, that... that. Two. <laughs> I want to hear the number here. What's your AC? 20. 20? Will, are you gonna reciprocate? Mine is 30. Yeah, I know. Oh, this is and what's your and, and just a question? Will, what's your, your value? Oh, right now? that's it. That's it right there. I can't hear what you just said, Tom. And, and I gotta, I gotta ask, Will, what's your gear? What's your total gear value right now? Including my gold or not including my gold? Not I'm, including your gold. Both. I don't hear both. Um, five hundred and seventy thousand. Yeah, mine's 81,000. Fuck you. Tom, did you get my text message? No. Oh, fuck. Shit, seriously? Admittedly, a large portion of that is just two items. Are you talking about... Are you talking about the, uh... The picture, me the picture message? Yeah, I got that. Yeah, <laughs> actually, like, half of my character wealth is two items. <laughs> Guys, I found a fanfiction! <laughs> it's... Yeah. There's billions of fanfiction. No, 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 guys, you understand. It has over three million words. Yeah, I've read those before. Naruto fandom, it's huge. No, I mean, like, in a single story. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I understand. understand. Guys, the Guinness Book Record, the Guinness Book World Record, longest word count in a four book right now, is only 1,200,000. Yeah, I'm familiar. I actually tried to buy that book. <laughs> This one is three million fucking dollars. What fandom is it from? It's a fucking Super Smash Brothers fanfiction. What? Yeah. Jesus Christ. The lo the okay. oh. That actually explains how it works perfectly because you can explore every character and all of their interactions. No, but here's the thing. They're OCs. For fuck's sakes, no. <laughs> I didn't read it, but that's what it fucking said in the fucking, like, intro thing, because I wanted to actually see if this person was fucking legit when they were talking about the fucking length of this shit. And, uh, no way. No, I'm not even fucking kidding. Let's see, I'm currently looking up the longest fanfiction I've ever read right now. It is a Legacy of Kane fanfiction. Sounds good. One of the, it was, it's really a really good one. Um... I have a game I would of, only read really good ones. <laughs> yeah, I only read my, really search, good ones. my search criteria is that it has to be at least 40,000 words or more. 
Oh. Uh, yeah, mine's a hundred thousand. Oh, mine's ten thousand, but I've. I am so thoroughly searched through this stupid okay, fucking Okay, I'm gonna go time. ahead and point this out. Three million words would be a little shorter than the first 12 Wheel of Time books. Okay, let's wow. see here. Uh, okay, this story, Legacy of Cain number 6, Resurrection of Nosgoth, is 188,000 words. I think the longest one I'm reading right now... Well, I can't tell because my other computer is dead because of the internet. Fuck my life. Um, oh, well, I have a chance to change my... <laughs> it was, speaking of it was a Star Trek fan fiction, and I think it was 70-something K words. Oh, and then there's the 50K word one, and then the 23K word one. I'm like, whoops. For the record, other than Magic Dealer, has anyone here read the Wheel of Time series? One book. One book? One book. Does anyone here in ever intend to read more of it? Uh, you know what? I've often thought about it, but that would require me to go and buy books. them, so... No, I could set to go. And then, yeah, and then you realize how many books there are in your series, like... Uh, I, got other, I got other things I can do with my time. I will send you a file with all of them in ebook formats. I heard I it's word oh, form. I heard it's just a shit ton of word form. I, I do own all of them, but I'm not going to mail them to you, so... Because, <laughs> dude, I, your shipping bill would be outstanding. <laughs> I understand that they're very long-winded. They're very hardcover, and the... the like, like, it's I a said. shelf. I have a shelf of Wheel of Time. I'm pretty so sure... What's the area of Spider-Man? Will, what items do you have that are so fucking expensive? He's a wizard, he doesn't give a fuck. Um, uh, them. Well, yeah, but my big three expensive items are my Staff of Evocation, my Greater Meta Magic Rod of Quicken, and my Archmage Robes. That makes a lot of sense, actually. And I'm pretty sure that the first two were given to you. Yes, I did not pay for those. <laughs> and then a lot, like my Archmage Robe, I actually paid half for because I crafted them myself. I hate everything about this program. <laughs> he's too. just he's just so bitter, it's great. <laughs> Good Good I miss map tools. Yeah, yeah, I, fuck, I don't know what that- Well, else. unfortunately, map tools is going through, like, it's midlife crisis right now. Which apparently it has, it has a lot of. <laughs> so, I've been having some, I, I, I don't even know at this point, but like recently I've been having really like weird dreams as far as I can remember. Like, cause I don't ever, when I do actually have dreams, I don't remember them that well. Cause typically I don't really have dreams, but I've been trying to figure out why they've been so just fucking weird as hell. And then I realized that I've been falling asleep at night listening to Welcome to Night Vale. <laughs> <laughs> and explained everything. Suddenly, you're like, oh, God damn it! Oh God damn! Okay, I'm gonna try something here real fast. Just bear with. What the hell is this black dot thing? Oh my God! What the fuck? Was this like a colory thing? What the? F I don't get it. I don't get uh, it. Oh, okay. So that's not gonna work. Okay. This room is a lot smaller than I remember it being. <laughs> That's because yeah. this map is finite in size. That's irritating. I think you can expand it. Hey, look! I'm a ninja! So apparently, I, I just... map? I just tried to see... expand map? That'll be 1025, please. What? Ah, huh, you're dead. No, you're back. I just... Everybody rushes. Okay, I just tried to see if I could log into this website using my tablet. No. I support on mobile on mobile devices. That's not a huge surprise, though. I'm not fucking shocked at all. Well, I just wanted to see if I could sit in my recliner and play the game and be a bit more comfortable. You have to suffer with the rest of us at our desks. Yeah, my dude. desk is actually like comfier than my bed because my bed's like 17 years old and dying. <sighs> I I could potentially actually haul my laptop up into my bed. 
That just sounds no. like a pain in the ass. Well, I don't have a bed. I have a bed topper folded in half on the floor. I'm sorry. That's awkward. And nor do I have a desk. I just That's have a fold up. <laughs> I just have a fold up TV tray that I place my laptop on. <laughs> oh, I feel so bad for you. Oh, I remember those days. I used to have a. Uh... I used to have my computer set up on a stack of boxes that I hadn't unpacked because I needed something to set my desk or my computer on. To be perfectly honest, there was a time of like half a year that my computer was its own stand. Mm. Good oh. times. Good times. Good times with that meme form. Yeah. So the purple shit is the wall of violence. Which we're not I'm going to throw a fireball at it. Not actually. <laughs> You I die. Oh yeah, I forgot right. about the, the the shelf of yeah. Let's not touch this shit. The, the shelf of don't fucking touch it. Oh, by the way, I am in. You threw a fireball. I'm teleporting my ass out. You're teleporting me with you because uh, I'm gonna hang with Firthus, uh for right now. <laughs> This is a very interesting thing here where Firth is, is the safe choice. Yeah, right. It, it actually makes sense because if you're throwing bombs and killing party members, you won't be hitting yourself. Oh, for fuck's sake. I forgot and to also, I have, have several... Um, God damn. I've got some buffs for you, too. Oh, here it is, actually. <sighs> Hiding. I've got some buffs for you, too. Anywho, so, so I'm not gonna blow it up. But so we just went and we go, went ahead and we rested in my mansion. Shall we start the new day, or do we want to do anything beforehand other than like prepare spells and stuff? You guys have spell lists? Yeah, <laughs> just just repair okay. stuff and. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, oh, I actually want to change one spell out. Actually, you should name uh, that spell Marilyn. Hey, magic dealer. Uh, when you go to sleep, you're in Marilyn Mansion. <laughs> 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 I'm Marilyn Manson. Welcome to my Marilyn Mansion. Ah, you saw that too. Yeah, I did. That he's, was a long time ago, actually. I know. He saw it. He saw his chance, and he took it. <laughs> he did. Admittedly, can you say you wouldn't? No, I would have. Uh, you'd be a fool not to. Is, wait, is, 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 it, 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 wait, is this something? Something he actually did? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> he's Cripps. He's like, oh, well, I'm Marilyn Manson and welcome to my Marilyn Mansion. Hey, hey I don't blame him. Hey, I'm <laughs> a greater I'm, spell slot to. I mean, it, granted, granted, I think the guy looks like a, a freak, but. I actually really like his music. He's a freak. Yeah, I, look, yeah, sure. it, it, yeah his, music is, his music is okay, but just. Like, he, he just needs to toe down his appearance. No, he doesn't. Uh, he's kind of got old, yeah. actually. He's not quite as crazy as he used to be. That is my updated spell loadout for the day. Ditto. I don't have a spell loadout! <laughs> yeah. I, I'm, I'm, uh... I'm, getting, I'm a little bit more... So we're now all very well rested, well fed, hopefully not too hungover, true blag. <laughs> Hey, point of interest, Fusus, you're an alchemist, right? Yes. And alchemists are immune to poison, right? Yes. Ha, you can't get drunk. Uh, I don't think it works out like that. Not alcohol is poison. <laughs> yeah. Al yeah. Right. What? Yeah, alcohol is poison. poison. You can't get drunk. I don't think so. No, sure. that's exactly how that works. Thing, actually. No, 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 no. There's a fort save uh, involved with getting drunk. It's a poison. I mean, if... Poison effect. I mean, if Firthus can't get drunk, I think he would probably... Well, granted, this version of Firthus is not my alcoholic version of Firthus, so... Not too bad. Well, I, I just... Versions of people, versions of True Black, versions of Firthus, and me and his dad are just sitting here going like, "What the fuck is this shit?" And Jix. Yeah. Are there versions of Jix? No. 
You know, it's just that there's a, a previous version of Firth as I played where he was a drunkard. He, he, he was a very atypical elf where instead of drinking tea, he would drink ale with the rest with everyone else. And there was one funny scene where he got drunk, threw up on a, on a wizard. My friends apologized. Uh, oh, though, okay. Well, then I promptly passed out. My friends apologized, paid the wizard a replacement for his robes. And as punishment, my, my friends decided to shave my head. Okay. Well. Best thing that ever happened to me, I played in a party once. This was the one where I ascended to be like a god of dark and blood ma magic and stuff. But the whole party ascended to godhood. But one of our party members was a... Um, they were a fighter. A, they were a gnomish fighter that worshipped alcohol. <laughs> Who later became the god, and I, I'm, I'm trying to remember how he worded this. There's an interesting way he worded this. The god, of, god of all wine? things. A god of all things. It, it was some. He worded it cleverly, and I can't remember how he did it now. But right. But also, this same wizard stole all of our horses. Sucks to your Asmar. I'm pretty sure you've all heard of my angry rats so, that ran to that session. So we proceeded to try and hunt his ass down, and we never found them. As a matter of fact, I quit playing with that group because of money reasons. It was an hour, it was an hour drive there and back, so I had to eventually drop out. But apparently, shortly after I dropped out, there was a total party wipe. So. Ouch. So no. So yeah. Right, Versus, we're ready to roll. the trunk was saved by a uh, long travel know. time. Yeah. I agree. Mean, my Firthus would have probably have found a way to escape. I think the only time I've ever ended up walking out of a game was a game I knew I was going to walk out from the beginning because I didn't like the DM. When he flat out rejects a completely legal character, that tells me something's up. Um, if he, though, I know Tom will reject you if you try to play a drow in his campaign. Yeah, That's but no, it was like basically he wouldn't let let my character exist because the way I had my backstory, I would actually know people, and he wanted pe wanted all of our characters to just be like mindless, like Skyrim starts. Do, 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 do. I would have just set out character creation. You're all starting in a small farming town. Um, you can know people in the town, but you don't know people out of it yet. Yeah, see, that would have been good, but no, he said just bring a character. So I made a character, and I brought it, and it got flat out denied. I'm sorry, I'm a wizard. I'm going to know people. No, that's not necessarily true. You can know people, but it's not guaranteed just because you're a wizard. Yeah, because Bronin was a wizard. He didn't know anyone. <laughs> you found Bronin in a box. <laughs> Never no, trust something you find in a box. We found Brian in a cave! With a, in, a, in a box of scraps! All a wizard really needs is a book to study from, not somebody to teach him. Yeah, it's not a self-taught thing. Wizard is not Wizardry is not intuitive. There are plenty of stories where people learn magic by finding grimoires, etc, etc. True. So it's entirely possible you could have been a wizard and not know people. But I agree I it's a dick like, move on the DM not to tell you ahead of the time that he wants to yeah. like, Either way, but that, just everything, he was so, he railroaded us so hard and would not let us make our own decisions, I just left. Terrible DMing. Yeah, railroading sucks, that's why I try not to do any of it. So. I like to do the opposite of railroading. <laughs> so this Drider just got attacked by, bodily rammed by a half-orc with spike armor, I got crit by a ranger with arrows. So, of course, it hits the cleric that had nothing to do when he's standing in the back, right? Okay, here's my D&D &D story for the day. <coughs> a level 2 party gets captured. The party can sit as a pretty standard. There's a rogue, a wizard, and a fighter. The goblin... The, they're captured by goblins. I might have forgot to mention that. Yeah. In the prison... The goblin chief goes up to the first one and says, to the fighter and says, We're going to, to grind weapons out of your bones, use your 
use your blood in our stews and turn your your flesh into a can into a canoe but you may choose how you die and the fighter said by the sword that makes sense I so he's killed by the sword okay goes to the wizard same same seal how do you choose to die the wizard says by a knife very like surgical precision like back of the head no pain kind of deal goes to the rogue and how do you choose to die he says I choose death by a fork all of the goblins lick in strangeness. They bring him a fork. He starts stabbing himself all over, screaming, Fuck your canoe. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys, was that actually a party wipe? Oh, I don't know, that's just a story I heard one day. Oh. It's, it's, a, it's an old joke. Um, the first time I heard it was with cannibals. It wasn't even D&D related, it was just... A yeah. bunch of cannibals. We're gonna kill you and use your skin for a canoe. Either way, I heard that I heard it just around a table one day, and it's just stuck with me. Fuck your canoe. Yeah, pretty much. It's always good for a laugh. All right. Shall we Back begin? to creepy room that we shouldn't be touching anything in. Oh, are, are we ready um, to begin? My D and D story is this. Oh, kind of okay. like there was once a group of adventurers who tried to play world's largest uh, door factory. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> that was a v okay. That was very short and to the okay. point. Okay, let's continue because we're it's almost fucking three. And so there's two doors, right? Yeah. Jack G. North side, and south side. I think we should go. Is that in character? Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and distinguish this. Oh, that was Tim, not yeah. Okay. Anything typed in character should still have quotation marks. So we have two boats. If you draw on my map, I will kill you. I'm destroying a compass because I don't want to get confused about which way is fucking north again. Up is north always. Then tell that to these. Whatever the case. Up is north. Alright. North is. Uh, damn it. Uh, Pretty sure there isn't any erase tool other than erase the whole fucking- Whoa! Um, that was a thing I didn't mean to do and I apologize. I have to erase the room probably now. I'm sorry. Nope. Watch me fix it. Do you just- Yay! Well, you just you just drew a yeah a white box yeah. Well. Whatever. <laughs> all right, so we're going north. I hate you all. <laughs> we love you too, Magic Dealer. Oh, you can delete your own drawings apparently. How? I don't know. I just did. Control Z, I maybe. And deleted it. No. Uh, no. Either way. Looks like you managed to- oh. Yeah, uh, just drag your select thing and I was able to select it a moment ago. You mean select- oh. Like, select it and then delete it. Yeah, you moved part of it. Picarding right now? Oh. Yay! So we're going north, I guess, is the general consensus? Yeah. Right. Let's, just, let's just go north. I agree that Bertha should open the door, since Bertha has ridiculously high AC. But no strength if it's stuck. I could... whatever. Yeah. We can, we can all run our, elf, our, our shoulders into it like we always do. Okay, so Jix is... Trinity? Apparently, yes. Um, I really wish for this was Trinity. I would be laughing my face off at all times. I always thought Trinity looked kind of mousy, so. That's true. Anyway. What <laughs> Pearson is going to attempt to kill himself. I mean, open the door. <laughs> all right. And then Tom killed me through the screen. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm gonna do a perception check on the door. It appears to be a door. 
<laughs> I always love that response. It appears to be a stone door. Okay, but, okay, uh, I'm gonna try and open it. Imagine today, what's the stone door made out of? It is made out of... <laughs> no, actually, it's made out of stone. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> it is, uh, it doesn't open when you, uh, go to open it. Oh, shit, Will! It... I almost forgot that, uh, you have... Wait, wait, what, what, what armor are you missing again? Me? No, you're, you're Zed. What about Zed? What armor is he missing? Is this left or right? Left. Left, okay, cool. Anyway, you said what now? The door does not open. Okay, so... Uh, is, is it, it lo locked or stuck? Do you have disabled device? I do! I do. Pierce's does too. By all means, roll it and see if you can determine. Alright. Oh, no, I didn't want to open that one. Here we go. Uh, this is 16. Roll. 31. I beat you. With a stick, yeah. while you step, but on horse flats, the man's unbeatable. Uh, the door is uh, is uh, quite well stuck. <sighs> Fortunately, I have better strength score now. <laughs> uh, if you prefer, I can no, just, no. If you prefer, I can just open it. Oh yeah, that's right. You have knock, don't you? Yeah. Uh, yeah, by all means. That's the thing we really need in this party. <laughs> hey, hey, magic dealer, is the uh, uh, the flush me uh, area is that open? It's I water. It's a pit of water currently. That's water in there. Okay, I flip, flip, flip over there, and 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 take cover. You're such a pussy ass little shit, Iron Bite. <laughs> I don't trust this. <laughs> If, so, if you, uh, I don't actually if you have want to cover, walk, you will actually. I don't have actually to, have to walk up to the door to open it. So, if, if you yeah. want to take cover in there, you will actually have to go underwater. The water is damn near level with the the floor. Uh, I don't actually have to walk up to the door to open it. So you can keep standing in front of it, Fiercest. You can open it as soon as I unlock. No, it. I'm going to stand on the side of it just in case. Gee, thanks, guys. We've we've learned from the water door incident. I'm just gonna go ahead and move behind away from the vials. Standing behind my best friend. Best Sometimes. friends forever. <laughs> I'm I gonna go ahead on the door. door. What was that, Tom? I'm gonna go ahead and stand in the opposite corner. <laughs> well, not stand, float, overland flight, and all that, but whatever. I okay. cast knock on the north door. All right. Uh, simultaneously, all the vials knock. Uh, the door uh, groans and opens. Um, however, um, as it does open, all the vials uh, shake in their little holders on the wall. Oh. <laughs> uh, okay. Probably I'm a curiosity. better choice than uh, trying to slam into the door to open it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm going to ask you a question. Yeah? Uh, is this room to scale? Like for measurements purposes, um, barring uh, access to map tools, yes. Gotcha. <laughs> uh, uh, it has. Uh, we we have limited map space after. Okay. okay, that's fair. Darn, that's not a. I was hoping that was gonna be a minute per level thing, not a. Yeah, okay. Uh, tread carefully. <sighs> All right. What do we see on the other side? Uh. <clears throat> you know, I probably shouldn't have Doritos for breakfast. This it's part okay. I'm just going to describe instead of drawing out. Um, again, due to space constraints. Um, there is a fairly long hallway in front of you. Stretches straight northward to what looks like another door. Um, also stone. Uh... It appears to be um, maybe 40 feet long, and uh, near the door where you're at, there is a big red button, and near the far door, there is another big red button. Buttons. 
Oh god, buttons. Well, there is, this is uh, your family home. Let yourself in. Hmm. Let's see, should I should I press the shiny candy like button? <laughs> I'd be terrified. <laughs> Why do you default on purple, you son of a bitch? Cause purple's a fucking rat ass color. Looks blue to me, but my eyes are kind of weird, so. You know what? Unfortunately, that's... It's purpley blue. Yeah. So, um, hmm. I suppose we uh. should explore a little bit before we start pushing random buttons in the wall. I suppose we should... Uh, check for traps! Uh. Sorry, what was that, Jackie? I heard some kind of thing about... She's a trap? It's kind of not a polite thing to say anymore. I think we're past that social time. <laughs> Well, well, uh, traps are pretty much your domain, Jackie, so... Not in perception. Uh, Ooh, perception what, what you're... Okay. I'll make a perception roll. I'm not make... the biggest perception Jackie person. I'll roll one in a minute, I'm just playing some music for myself. Uh, remember, yeah. perception can only, uh, look at mechanical traps. Magical traps have to be done with, uh, somebody with trap finding. Nope. Um, I don't see shit. I thought I thought you could find magic traps, but you couldn't disable magic traps. No. Don't uh, worry, guys. The bat sees nothing. Perception to see traps. Um, there is a... It's... Fairly obvious to you, based on your examination of the hallway, that the big red buttons, the big red button next to you, is uh, linked to activate a trap. Oh, hold on, Dad's calling me. Dad. Oh, wait. Have a steak to make. No, I was gonna roll perception as well, I think. Just to make sure. Just because I said I have a decent perception roll, I'm gonna get do terribly. Is it two slashes or one slash roll? I can't remember one. already. One and then rolling. Or is it roll? Can you just do Yeah. Oh my god, there it is. It's one slash roll, one D twenty plus like, well, there's my only good roll for the day. This is gonna be so much easier. Shut my window. Oh, <laughs> well, that's pretty bad. Hey, we have the same uh, perception mod. Yep. I feel like I don't even need to roll, but whatever. So far, 37 is highest. <sighs> uh, I, I can't even see 37, so... <laughs> even when rolling in that 20, I wouldn't be a 37, so... It comes close. <sighs> Sorry, gents, when your dad calls you answer. Um so, so I don't really understand this, but for some reason in my skill code, it says I have perception trap line like twenty which is higher than my nap perception. Okay. Uses the living hell out of me. Wait, what's higher than your natural perception? My trap finding apparently. Is it run off a different modifier? Uh, nope, both perception. Or, uh, wisdom, rather. I would suggest you look to your magic items. Yeah. Oh, that's probably it, yeah. Anywho. So, I guess that would be a 38 if I'm trap finding. So, what was with the, um, what was with the creepy hallway I've done that I missed for my roll? So my dad called me right in the middle of the explanation. 
the red button uh, near you activates a trap. Yeah, so just don't press the fucking button. Duly so noted. Like, I don't, like, don't Aram doesn't curse. Maybe it's a good friendly trap. Zed. Giant friendly mushroom cloud! Have we ever, in our entire experience of, of adventuring, ever found one friendly trap? Yes. Name it. In Eric's lair, the sigil that made us run away. <laughs> because if we had listened to it, we wouldn't have had to fight the big spider that killed me. It didn't kill you? Mostly killed me. I was very unconscious. I was almost dead. Says the dude who didn't get affected by the fucking trap! Yeah, but the spider corpse falling almost bid me in. <laughs> dude, th that was a what? A symbol of fear or terror? Like... <sighs> she was probably not that fucking pleasant! <laughs> it was a symbol of David Carradine. Like I hey, said, not that fucking pleasant. You said it was a symbol of Elvis. What's wrong with Elvis? Story straight, man. Good god, man, leave our American a... icons out of this shit. There's no way I can keep my story straight. <sighs> that crooked, eh? Are we going? Yeah, are we gonna walk through the hallway of doom? I, I, I suggest the per people who can actually fly go through. <laughs> I... I vote for this. <laughs> hey, for this! It's your house, why don't you go first? Yeah, sure! Alright, I'll... So, I'll... You're heading down the hallway? Yes. Okay. Euler and Wizard go last, just saying. As you pass the red button, it seems almost low to call you to it. DO NOT PRESS THE BUTTON! Because that's totally your personality. Save, gonna fail. It's a big red button all by itself on the wall. <laughs> Looking all alone. Who knows what could happen? Nobody's pressed it in so long. Maybe never. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say will say. Don't say will say. Don't say will say. I mean, will save, or you're gonna take full damage. <laughs> will save, or I'm gonna take full damage. No, will save, or you're gonna take full damage. What <laughs> oh, save am I rolling? Oh, nothing. I'm just messing. <laughs> so I get it, but. But, I thought we were just totally okay with it, like, okay, what the fuck did we do now? <laughs> I'm just kind DM says roll a save, I roll a save. <laughs> it's better than him saying, you take this much damage. True, yeah. So, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and ask you one last time, Perthus. Do you abandon that unpushed button all by itself? <laughs> uh, I'm going to err on the side of caution and common sense and not do that. He has a little arrow sitting on his shoulder going like, if you push it, I will kill you in the night. I don't know who you are anymore. Okay. <laughs> it's, called like, it's called if you push it, he'd have a pissed off fetchling that can go invisible on his ass. You make it down the, uh, the hallway to the other door. Uh, and the other red button. The other red button. Can you resist the other red button, Brett? <laughs> Yes, I'm going to resist the other red button. It's almost winking at you. <laughs> oh. well, hi there, Frithis. I could do all sorts of interesting things. Push me, Frithis. Come on. No, no you want. <sighs> this is like Frithis' version of the ring. <laughs> <laughs> With shiny, shiny red glowing buttons. <laughs> it's like... Like, I, I what's Aram's one rule? Uh, well, actually, I kind of have a more than one rule, but there's just one. Don't big rule. touch the thing. 
<laughs> that's the thing I'm known for. Don't put, don't touch the thing. God damn it! Uh, you touched the thing once, didn't you? He touched Ronan's <laughs> dark little heart. Yeah, don't you remember <laughs> that when I became insane? <laughs> hey, to be fair, I touched it too indirectly. Yeah, but you're yeah, you are already insane. You, you touched it through the power of music. I got forced to do it. I failed my ego my ego save. <laughs> Which is pretty fucking hilarious. <laughs> uh, hey there, wizard. That's that's currently holding me. You should do this thing. No, I'm not gonna do the thing. Do the thing. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Somehow, I think you probably didn't resist all that hard. <laughs> Based on how ca catastrophically I failed the save, I think I agree with you. <laughs> I really want to touch it! He's like, uh, right, uh, like, touch it. No, I don't want to. Touch do it! To you know, you make a very valid argument. <laughs> yeah. Do I need to bring up the other, the other Lich's artifacts and then the door incident? To be fair, I was considering stabbing myself with the spike after I found out what it did, but... <laughs> <laughs> it turned things undead. I kinda wanna be undead, so it kinda made sense. At least become a witch if you're gonna come undead. I think that's his game plan, is become a lich. Probably would've just turned you into like some mindless undead zombie. Yeah. And roll a new character. Okay. Okay. Well, I guess okay. you'll never know now. Nope, I gave it away. <sighs> Temptation was too strong. Alright, so what are you guys doing? Brothers is on the other side of the hallway, staring intently at the red button. <laughs> I'll go down next. <laughs> For the record, here, if I think you're going to press the button, I'm going to dominate you. <laughs> oh, that's part of PvP that will fly you. I will top you so hard. <laughs> it's okay. I just have to like you know stare down him at the hallway, just unblinking. <laughs> and he won't fucking do it. I hope. Somebody get the squirt bottle. <laughs> Bad for this. No, no pressing buttons. I'll go after. Ah, but I want to. <laughs> <laughs> but I want to press the button. All right. Well, so, the so I go down the hallway. So there's another door at the end of the, at the end of the hall then. Yes. All right. I want to try and open open up the door. Um, it does not open. <sighs> Is it stuck too? Why you roll to find out? And perception. Spin that wheel. Well, wait, wouldn't it be disabled device to see if it's locked? Yep. Alright, disabled device. 25. Um, it appears to be stuck in place. <sighs> Alright, I'm gonna... I'm gonna try and force it open. Uh, just to note, we've all gone down the hall at this point. Yeah. So you're all in the hole now. Okay. All right. Let's see. Uh, marching order, just for argument's sake. All right. Let's see what we got here. I'm after for this. Uh, that's not gonna do it. You sneeze while you're trying to open it. Aww. Ow. Oh. Right. Now you have to push against your own goo. Try it. Gross. Do it again. Try not to get a hernia this time. Yeah, yeah old man. Aww. You sneeze again, there's a lot of dust. <laughs> I don't Babby have... sneezes. Come on. Kind of unpanned a little bit. Come on, damn it. Open! Ah, <laughs> oh, come on! You sneeze and, and um, let out a little shark. It was unexpected. <laughs> Just a little one, though. Uh huh.
You know what, since my camera's uh, off, I want to take this damn shirt off now. I'm At this point, I'm fairly confident our rat folk witch is stronger than you. <laughs> uh, you, you might be right. But the wizard might be stronger than you. Walks over, rips the railing off, <laughs> sets it off to the side. <laughs> I fucking love that movie. <sighs> Aren't you forgetting something? <laughs> what? The paralyzing fear of water. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Wait, what movie is this? <laughs> what? Gamers, Darkness Rising. Oh. Uh. Damn it! That's like been recommended to me, I can never find that damn thing. Quick! It's good. Knock there was the a link posted down. it in our chat like last week. Oh, really? Yeah, I yeah. did. Yeah. I, I can find it again and post it for you if you want. Yeah, Not right private. now. Yeah, just later. Not yeah. right now. Right. Um. <laughs> I'm waiting. Giggity. <laughs> the shaft. We didn't. We have not had someone of, shall we say... He's talking about the dinosaur. Oh, oh, the dinosaur, oh, yeah. Just, just clearing that up before you run your round. <laughs> I, I, I may if we haven't had, you know, like a fighter type oh, or something, a fighter. Really funny. You know, that we haven't had like a fighter or a barbarian type, so. We had the BFG in the beginning. Yeah. All right. Let's, all right. Let's, I remember how that ended. No wait. The big. No, the BS. BSF. Sorry, I'm getting my acronyms mixed up. All right. Let's try this again. Fuck. This is really pathetic. Yeah. It's actually. You ripped a little skin off your knuckle that time. Admittedly, he actually has a bigger strength bonus than me. What's Pierce's strength bonus? Three. Plus three. Oh. Oh, that's not bad. It almost looks like Firth is just trying to do something improper with the door. <laughs> I bet whatever you're typing right now, just stop. Stop. <laughs> Stop right now. <laughs> uh, I must admit, this is rather embarrassing. Uh. <laughs> like you'll want to talk, True Blag. You, you've try, you'll try to do anything with leaves. That was well, to oblige, do you wish to have a try at it then? Perhaps you could be a bit more mm, persuading. <laughs> Likes them cobalt muscles. <laughs> I'll be honest, I do not have anything that opens doors. <laughs> I do. I'm waiting for someone to politely ask me to use it. <laughs> well, I mean, you've. Well, how many times are you? Do you have knock prepared? Three. Uh, we don't want to burn burn out through all of them. So uncomfortable. Hi, <laughs> well, if you're uncomfortable, you have a try, big strong ninja. Down here. I like Jix's sense of humor. Jix, I think we're gonna get along well. <laughs> <laughs> I just ran with Thompson. Oh my fucking god, I think I love her. <laughs> Alright, let's try this. I kind of look back at everyone and just. Alright, let's try Let's have another try at this, shall we? <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> so, uh. This, Power uh, of embarrassment. 
Perthus uh, slams into the door, knocking it open. Um, and in fact, knocking little stone chips off of it. Jesus and Christ! And manly grunt of rage and power. <laughs> as simultaneously the door behind you slams closed. I'm looking at this as a super manly chest bump. Wait, what do you mean it closes again? The door behind us. Oh. Oh, fuck. Well, they're probably designed to op to be open one at a time. <laughs> I uh, have to Guys, see. I'm gonna open us to the possibility that might have been an airlock. Think about it. Two stone doors. Very, very difficult to open. When one opens, the other closes. Do you feel like you're getting a sore throat? I think I'm getting... Do you have a sore throat? I might be getting a sore throat. Is my skin turning red? <laughs> uh. All right. Holy shit, my fingernails are turning blue! <laughs> Dudes! Alright, so what do we Dude. see in the other room? Dudes. <laughs> Rolling perception Dude. to notice if I'm Where's dying. Where's my car? <laughs> I'm rolling perception to see if I'm dying. As am I. Would that be a heal check? Well, it would be a heal check, wouldn't it? Hold on, what's my heal score? Yeah, I gotta look that up too. Roll one D. I think his skill score is probably higher than my skill score. Since he's a wisdom based character. <laughs> <laughs> Not by much, but it is. Oh. Holy crap, you're healed. Uh, guys, I am rolling like shit right now. We all are. We all are. <laughs> well, you know, except for the whole. Uh... Nat 20 that Brett just rolled. And how many bad rolls did he have to go through before he reached that point? Four. And that was his only good roll today. It took him 30 seconds and then he busted that door open. That's not bad, actually. Like a boss. Well, and with taunting in between, but... <laughs> yeah. Um, so the room in front of you... Good your ribbing. Uh, ...appears to be completely empty. And none um, of us notice that we're dying? Not yet. I'm dying! Uh, you do notice a uh, very obvious, not at all concealed, uh, uh, openings in the uh, ceiling. Um, um <laughs> guys... They're uh, probably, uh, they're, they're about the size of a, of a quarter each, and they're, um, all across the ceiling. Yeah, I'm Are we in a concentration that. camp? I'm sensing a, I'm sensing a ceiling crap. Magic dealer, are we in a concentration camp? <laughs> Do you smell toast? <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> I'm sorry. Ouch. I was, I was reading the darkest thread, uh, the darkest jokes you know thread on Reddit the other day. That's right. By the other day, I mean yesterday. And that, that was, was a good thread. I like that one. Yeah. I got linked to it. But but do you see my logic here? Airlock, get room with seats with holes in the ceiling. This seems like a gas chamber to me. No wait, no wait. Um, I was reading um, short uh, right, the scariest horror story you can write in two sentences. Oh, I remember that. I didn't read that one. That was good. I like that one. How there was a couple good how, ones. How does that work? How you write that? a you write a horror story in two sentences. It's it's kind of like. I was the last man on Earth, and then someone knocked on my door. That kind of thing. Well, that still leaves room that it could have been one of the women on Earth, if you're the last man. Just saying. <laughs> Probably gonna get called upon to do your manly duty in that scenario. No, actually not necessarily, because we just found a scientific way to, like, take a bone marrow from a lady and then turn it into the genetic material acquired to create a child. So technically we don't may need guys anymore. Fuck! That uh, is, but guys, so, so, so in other words, my chances of getting laid have just went down even further. Shit. <laughs> this one was my favorite. It's the very first one on this Google search I just Okay, did. I'm sorry. I have, to, I have to mention this. 
Brett, have you seriously never gone to a con? No. Con is like you, any type of convention that's about gaming, <laughs> anime, anything like that. Your your intelligence instantly becomes your penis size. <laughs> okay. This is my um, as someone who has gone to a con and is a woman folk, that don't fucking mean jack. <laughs> hey, hey, uh, hey. Okay, I don't normally tell people this because I'm a decent person. No, but not. if you're desperate, book a room at a con way in advance so that you definitely have a room. Then when the con is closing at around uh, whenever it is, usually 11 or 12, there will be people looking for a room to stay in. He's actually not lying. I'm not lying. This happens. Uh, I've so depending actually... on your level of desperation... There you go. I'm not even it's, kidding. I have that's like three border, friends. That's like borderline prostitution. It really I is. have three friends Four. who have all gone to cons for that exact reason. Every con in the, in the city near me. And they always, yeah, every yes. time. So here's my favorite creepy that's ass. Creepy. 100% success rate. I learned that from Reddit. <laughs> that's so fucking creepy. I know. Here's something even creepier. I began tucking him into bed and he tells me, Daddy, check for monsters under my bed. I look underneath for his amu amusement and see him. Another him. Under the bed, staring back at me, quivering. That's more than two sentences. Daddy, there's somebody on my bed. Oh, yeah? That's that's the one that I read. They got me to go read the thread. It was a pretty oh, yeah. nice this Here's one. Happened. Here was my this favorite. I'll, I'll tell you my favorite. I remember it. Um, It was two long sentences, so it hardly counted. Um, yeah, see, that's more than two sentences. They just added commas instead of periods. It technically makes it a sentence, though. <laughs> uh, if, if you use that logic, you could have a thirty thousand page or thirty thousand word sentence. Ever ever heard of semicolons? <laughs> so here was the one I remember. A little girl hears her mother calling to her from the kitchen. Kitchen, and she goes that, and she goes to to see why she's calling for. Her. On her way there, the mother pulls her under- A hand reaches out and pulls her into the cupboard under the stairs. It's her mother, who says, Don't go into the kitchen, I heard it too. <sighs> it's always like creepy when it involves children than doppelgangers. <laughs> yeah. Wait, what do you mean your Roth IRA is empty? That's uh, my two sentence horror story. Oh. Yeah, no, it's fucking terrifying. Fucking, right? Okay. Anyways. Anyway, so, we're in a room. Uh, see, we're in the room. <laughs> oh, oh, wait, wait. Is there a door over here? There is a door. I'm not going in that room until there is a clear path to get through it. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I still feel like this is a gassing chamber and we're in a concentration camp. You know, one that's not easily accessible? You don't know nothing! Uh, this is probably, if anything, a, ser a sterilization chamber or something. Actually, um... I don't want to be sterilized! I think it's actually a testing chamber because if I have no right, those all those vials contain all of the um, evil crap they were gassing the things with, so they're probably sticking people in these rooms and then gassing them. So, half... Well, nobody went and checked out the vials, so... That's, that's because the, the shelf they were on was so unstable that it was at risk of flying over. If you if you, if you breathed on it wrong. And that's because the ninja was giving dirty looks to anyone who got near them. Well, yeah, there was that too. <laughs> I should make cookies. So, what do we do? I stand outside the room and wait until there's a path through. I'm gonna stop going to settle on uh, Jix's uh, shoulder. I'm not going into that room. Wizard I see we have Bertha try to open the other door. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's... While checking for traps. Uh, He's already dead. He's too far gone. <laughs> Keep in mind, we're all still in the hallway, too. With the door open. Yeah, actually, you know what? Maybe we should all get into the room in case this door closes. 
I have a, okay. I have a backup plan if things start going wrong. I feel okay. confident enough. I feel confident being around the wizard as well. well with it's greener teleport, isn't it? <laughs> I almost forgot yeah. to mention these uh, walls also glow with magic. Oh, <laughs> son of a bitch! It's just I like all the other construction in the city, pretty much. I still feel confident. All right, I think you know what if. If he's feeling confident, I'm gonna go ahead and follow him. He seems like a pretty confident magic caster. Competent magic caster. You only make that mistake once. Remember yeah, I will. I ice-killed Aram? <laughs> what? Remember that one time I ice-killed Aram? Yeah. An extremely competent magic caster. You mean after you black tentacled me? <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, I don't know any of this yet. <laughs> I should really write hentai. Oh, please don't. And if you, but if you, if you, if you must, please, please give me character rights to Arrow when you do it. I'm kidding. <laughs> oh man. So uh. Cause it's kind of happened twice now. Whoops. My Kingmaker character uh, uh, is a, a tentacle uh, spawn tiefling. Cool. Hilarity ensues frequently. So what are you guys doing? We're all in the room again. Yes, you are. Because apparently all we're all idiots. I reserve judgment. This is open that door. All right, I want to try opening up the well, door. This actually well, has more room, so technically we can o we can help him open this one if it's jammed. So perception checks, everybody. Yeah, we should all roll perception and. Fear if just should roll his trap finding. Not his trap you mean finding. I can roll trap finding. Not his uh, sense, no, like trap detection thing. All right. thing. Um, yeah, it's disabled okay. device. That's the one. Um, hold on just a second. Uh, for this, which uh, roll was the 35? That was perception. Okay. All right, this is uh, me for traps. It does appear to be something. What? Nothing. I I fucked up. I'm used to. I'm used to blah. You're used to the program we like. Yeah. Uh, Trap fighting. Woo. Uh, there does appear to be a uh, uh, thing that will activate if you touch the door. Um. There's not really any way to deactivate it though. The mechanisms are all set up inside the stonework. As in above? Yep. Wait, as in like physically touch it or if you just mess with it in any form? If uh, if the door is touched or move, moves at all, the mechanism will activate. So it's basically like, we can knock it, but no. So... Does my delving armor work in here? What? My delving armor. What the hell is delving armor? It gives me a burrow speed. <laughs> um, I believe you can only. Uh, I, I don't think you can burrow through stone, so. I think you're right. So. Nice try, I, though. But it's wait, if the door opens or moves, what if the door ceased to exist? That would constitute it moving. Yeah? <laughs> Because it's I wasn't sure. in the same position. I'm dumb. I what figured if, ceasing to exist might might be a... What, what if the trapping mechanism ceased to exist? Well, maybe it would be disabled, or maybe it would activate. Hey, guys, I'm dumb. Okay. okay. What else is new? I'm kidding, sorry. I was in a... stone... Building, right? Uh. I could have gone Earth Elemental. Uh. And Earth glided around. The walls uh, are magic. The, the magic on the walls prevents it. Damn it. Uh, oh, good. Stone. Yeah. <sighs> this is one of those times where I'm going, I wish I had that one spell, but I don't. I wish I had a lot of stuff. I wish I had a lot of stuff. I wish I had armor that was. 
I'm sure it'll turn up sooner or later. A magic dealer doesn't seem to be the kind of person that's going to, just going to make it. That shit just. So, magic dealer, it's not a trap that I can actually, like, you know, disable, disable? right? That's correct. What the fuck is my disable skill for then? There are traps you can disable and, and the traps that you can't. Yeah, it, like, you remember that one trap that you tried to disarm and, well, it went off? Yes, Berthus, tell me, who's the one that originally failed to fuck that who, who originally failed to pick that lock and then left me to the second choice? Well, you had a better chance of, you know, getting it, but... Then I rolled a one. Yeah. Thanks. The problem is that the nearly the whole mechanism is um, not accessible. Yeah. The only thing that's accessible will activate it if it's interacted with at all. Stop! So, shall we try at least risking opening the door or turning uh, back? I'm just that yeah, the, the first door is closed. Remember? Well, I can, I will, I can only assume that once we try to open up the that door, the other door will shut, or vice versa. What do the buttons do? We're not pushing the buttons. That. Well, I'm just curious because we were told they certainly activate a trap. Well, I can only. This is a trap. I might be able to theorize that if this is a laboratory and this might be some sort of washing or sterilization chamber. The and, gas and chamber, come on. And with those two. And with the two double doors, uh, those buttons might be an alarm for a containment breach. Why the fuck would you have a button for a containment breach? In case whatever you're working on were, you know, may get out. In a long ass hallway that's already closed? No, no, no. Because you'd go into the hallway, press the button, the doors would switch, the doors would close, and the gap and the chamber with the ga gas holes would sterilize. Which my personal guess is sterilized by acid. Mm, I'd, I'd sterilized by fire, but that's just me. You know, like you know what I mean, though. Like sterilized by purging the room of all things. Well, I mean, technically, if you really want to, to purge it, just open up a, you know, like a. Huge dimension door or something in there, and just, just whisk everything. Dimension you'll... doors are not a physical door. Oh well. Or... Plus, alchemists seem to be more kill it than trap it. Were they the ones that sealed up these giant beasts? <laughs> these giant beasts, though. They would have killed them if they could. That is true. <laughs> you don't really kill a trask, though. <laughs> <laughs> true story. You get killed by Trask, or eaten whole, and then dumped into a pocket dimension in its stomach. <laughs> uh, which apparently has a thriving wizard community in it now. Hey, maybe I could go there to gather funds for my tower. Or maybe- or maybe- Oh yeah, I'm sure these wizards would be happy to contribute to your tower. <laughs> maybe- Well, they've already got their own da tower. Yeah. Goodness knows none of them want their own towers. <laughs> what if they have their own in the Trask belly? Huh? Then why would they donate to somebody they don't care about? Why are they? Why do they have money in the first place? They're That's wizards. actually the most valid argument I've heard so far. Because <laughs> they got swallowed into the belly. They didn't just, you know, appear there naked with no items. That would yeah. suck. Also, what, you what got all the people who were swallowed, died, and then their shit went to the to the portal. True. So here's my next thing. What are we doing? Like I said, we'd always try opening up the door, see what happens. Damn. You know, well, you know so fun party good. wipe there. Mm. Or we can try Ooh. going back down the hallway and... Yeah, let's opening the up the door. other door, going back through the room for vials and trying this outside. Uh. Full party vote. Who says what? Who says which? Open this door or try going south? Hmm. 
Man, am I tired? And it's dinner time, so I'll be back. Okay. Tell me if you <laughs> die. Ah, oh, Jix, that's so cute. Jix wants to leave, Iron Bite wants to go south. Brett, what do you want to do? Uh, part of me just wants to keep going forward. Forward, yeah. uh, Aram. What do you want to do? Has Will voted yet? Nope. Nope. Wizard always reserves his vote for last. <laughs> so far we have one south, one forward, one impartial. And one get the fuck out. Yeah, the impartial is one get is to get the fuck out. I'm, I haven't given my vote yet. Iron <laughs> bites on reserve because he's. You know. Yeah. So, what do you guys? I need votes from you people. I'm thinking. Okay! That's two and one, and the wizard likes to take risks, apparently. Because Zed says... Okay, well, let's push forward. I'm, uh, I'm gonna prepare to, you know, uh, dodge spikes from the ceiling, so... I leave the room. Uh, that, your other option is the hallway, alone. Uh, there's no good option, is there? There's a wizard with greater teleport. There's a wizard of a lot of things. Fine, I'll stay around. However, I would suggest... I wish there was some way we'd be like, prepare for the worst. Get like an initiative bonus for being ready. It's called <laughs> not being surprised. <laughs> I, At that point, I, I, like, we'd always get, like, an initiative bonus, just because we're always, like, well, Aaron would at least, because he's extremely paranoid at all times, pretty much. Welcome to every adventurer ever <laughs> who has survived past level four. Fair enough. So, Fiercest, open that door! Alright, let's try opening, an opening up the door. Well, are you going to be all the way in the back there? As hey? soon as you touch the door... Uh, as you start to work on getting it open, um, the other door uh, closes, and gas starts emitting from the holes in the ceiling. Yeah, fucking uh, call it. Let's hit the door. Come on, brother. This. Do I have a? Uh, ac can I take an action? If you want. Yeah. Zed dramatically waves his staff around, doing this quickly, albeit. Taps it on the ground, and a wall of force appears, coating, covering the ceiling. Hey, he prepared all the force finally. <laughs> yes, prepared. That's what I did. <laughs> <laughs> so actually, I have a staff that casts it. Oh, fucking sweet! Versus, do you want to try to get this door open? Yeah, I'm trying yeah. to get it open. Is it stuck? Hold on, I'm checking something. Uh. 
He's checking to see if gas can go through a wall of force. The wall of force. It's wall an impenetrable force. wall of right, force. It must be a flat vertical plane. Oh, it has to be vertical? Yep. Well, fuck, that's, that's useless. Fire. That's useless. No, I can't do that then. That's an invalid action. It creates a vertical wall of force. The gas falls on the other side. That won't work. Uh, okay. Uh, no, we all die then. Earth hit the door! <laughs> I'm trying! Uh, do you have quick disable, by the way? Quick disable? Yeah. Just no. be no. the amount of time. No. Oh, for fuck's sakes, I burn a knock. You can let Six me try seconds. to pick it, come on, man. Six seconds to burn a knock, and the door for sure opens. Fine. Valid action, magic dealer? One second. Um, if you want, you can burn a knock, uh, and, uh, it may work. Um, at the same time, though, it's not going to be before the gas hits y'all. So, not quick enough? Not quick enough. Hmm. I have a mask on, does it give me any pluses? <laughs> <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I'm not dead yet, so just keep your fur on. And nor have we taken any actions. Are, are you going to blow the knock or what? I'm thinking about it. It's not quick enough to prevent the gas from hitting us is the problem. Well, we have healers. Well, um, when the gas does hit you, uh, it doesn't feel like it's burning your flesh away. Because that's what you're worried about. Yeah, but it could also be like knocking us out or doing any kind of terrible things to a respiratory system. Slowly killing us, poisoning us. There's a That's list. what a fortitude save is for, come on! Okay, yeah, I burn the knock. Alright, let me uh, get back to my note page. I'm not exactly sure how this would work, because this is a timed lock. Uh, all locked doors, it opens. It honestly kind of does sound like a decontamination chamber. <laughs> if it's a timed one, it really does sound like a decontamination chamber, and my paranoia might have actually been a little extreme. <laughs> Here's my counter argument alchemists are immune to poison. Oh. Yeah. I level alchemists. But yeah. also to be fair, um, it still can carry on your clothes, so you can still technically bring it. And you may be immune to it, but Here, it I can it make a caster level check against the DC of the lock. With a plus ten bonus. Um plus we'll uh there's such a There's such thing like me to roll it? I give up. Like I said, hold on, just give me a second to read the spell. Okay. You can be immune and still be a carrier, so... Yay! Like on your clothes and junk. Woo! Mmm, bad juice. The knock opens up to two means of closure. A secret doors. Locked or tripped opening boxes or chests. will Locked doors. Knock does not raise barred gates or similar impediments, nor does it affect rope spines. Uh, That's strange, Tom. You didn't get it from here from once. <laughs> didn't get what from where now? Oh, he's talking about thunder. Oh. Somebody brought the thunder, huh? I already made a Thor joke when we had a storm here a couple days ago. Lightning bring the thunder. Uh, okay, so... Um, I'm not overly fond of what follows. You cast knock on the door. You want me to roll a cast roll against the DC, or...? No, you cast knock on the door. The door opens, and... Um, 
uh, holes uh, in the floor open up as well. The what in the in the what in the floor? Quarter sized holes. Okay. Just in the area near the door because it's. Whoa! Dead. What's happening? Somebody just ping. Oh. Ooh, I can ding things. What the fuck? How do you do that? Hold down the mouth button. Oh, I see. <laughs> so yeah, I'm I'm curious as to what's happening. Well, the door opens and some holes near the door open in the floor. Are, like, are they still quarter size holes? They are quarter sized holes. The gas keeps coming down. Do we should we run out of the chamber, guys? Let's run out of the chamber. Let's leave. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Through the door. Okay. Uh, there is a hallway um, on the other side of the door, which I am also not going to draw in. Uh, but it appears to be the same length as the last one, and it has. Two red buttons, one by this door, one by the other. I fucking hate this place so much. Heel <sighs> tracks. Okay. Them as you go. Yeah, well, that was perfect. Okay. Uh, arrow. Turn that one. <laughs> other guy said, Man, I can't roll for shit today. He really can't. I blame, I blame, twenty roll 20. The other guy did cobalt with myself. God damn it, can I roll above a 10, please? No, I thought we established this long time ago. <laughs> a long, long time ago. I can I still can remember. Well, true black. You should probably roll field checks, too. Uh, he's at dinner. Not here. He, he's uh, uh, yes, I he's forgot in bat mode. Well, he's, he's taking a bat nap. You appear to have been sanitized. <laughs> God damn it, we got way too paranoid about that. See, I told you what the room was. I didn't believe you. <laughs> Why the fuck should we believe you? <laughs> because I have the highest intelligence of the party. And it's... Uh, actually... <laughs> what's your end? Oh god, we're gonna be having an intelligence war versus the wizard and the alchemist. I have a 1d4 penalty here and I'm willing to use it. Uh, cur <laughs> currently 28. 33. Suck it. <laughs> well, we know who won now. So you guys done measuring your dicks? <laughs> hey, I don't wait, till, cons. wait till I get my head banned. <laughs> da da da. Da da da. <laughs> da da da. This isn't uh, over, wizard. I, why don't you wait, have a I get my book of plus seven, five. I, 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 have I have one. I'm get. I, I have one. I'm getting a better one made. You read a book of plus five intelligence. You're arguing. I are had a plus about. six one for you made like ages ago. I'm. I'm getting. A, I'm getting a, a headband of mental superiority made. That's not going to help your intelligence get higher. It's going to help all of his mental stats get higher. Yeah. The back is always plus six. Take me higher. Either way, a solid way to burn 120k. Well, it was better than getting, um, there was another item I was, oh yeah, a tome of, well, there was a, it was a book of, to improve my wisdom score by five. I figured, eh, for like, like. Yeah, but it's an, in, it's an in it bonus. It's not a, uh, Equipment bonus. So if you lost it, you would still have the bonus. Mm, true. Um, so uh, after about uh, a minute, the rest of the uh, openings in the floor open, and the gas is drawn out uh, through those openings. Super ridiculous paranoid party is go. <laughs> I don't blame you. Fucking. You've played with Furthus, that's enough for me. 
uh, you know, a little, a little paranoia is, isn't too bad. I mean, it helps keep you on your toes and generally helps to keep you alive most of the time. Um, I find it all rather amusing. So. <laughs> yes. yes, I'm sure you do. <laughs> so, let's try the other door. Well, it is also stuck in the manner of uh, its people. All right, let's reinforce it open. Is everybody in the hallway? Yes. Okay. Damn it. Six. Well, Furthest is getting frisky with the door again. <laughs> this is... I seriously think it's this program. It's really weird. Uh, let's see here. Uh, <sighs> Dude, don't make those noises, please. He tried to torque it open, it didn't. Don't make those noises. They're really making me uncomfortable. Who does number two work lower? I keep forgetting we actually have some fucking estrogen in the party now. <laughs> Except it's a rat, so you can't really tell. I don't know, True Black might still fuck it. You no, I'm fuck? kidding. Yes, I wanna do. He only really goes for dryads, apparently. Hey, Joey's a real player, though. <laughs> yeah, apparently Joey really is a player. Oh, Joey. Joey's oh, like a father Jeff. of Joey's like a father of five, I bet. At least. <laughs> so did did I get the door open? Not with a seventeen. Son of a bitch. The wizard wants to try. Alright, let's all right, let's have the great wizard try to open up the door. Wait, as in like like a one d zero? I don't think is gonna work. So um. I can I can help. Go team venture. We get him. Uh, ah, I still rolled better than most of your rolls. <laughs> That's a minus one. Yeah. Get the fuck away from the door. <laughs> <laughs> the door without moving bitch slaps you. <laughs> hey, I rolled a 12. That was higher than a lot of his rolls. It tells you not to take its DC for granted. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you bastard. Jake <laughs> uh, just sits in the back and giggles. Which sounds like squeaking because rat folk. Maybe a little stoned. <laughs> Alright, let's try this again. <laughs> 19. Hey! Oh, so close. Oh, it's a DC 20, isn't it? It is. Like, it is. you bastard. Oh, what if I try to roll to help him, and by help him, I mean run into him also running into the door. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> What's the fuck Do it. Do it. I want to see the roll. I want to see Brett take damage from this, but you know, that's besides the point. Or a fierce <laughs> Fuck! We're fucking assholes! Yes, we you are. Just kind of, you, you just kind of bounce off. <laughs> Versus, you barely even notice. You're like, what? <laughs> what the fuck are you doing, Aram? He's like, son of a just don't open the door! Uh. Sorry, no soap here. Alright, come on, open! Uh, let's three open the fucking door! Heck! No! Uh. Please do not make those noises. It's <laughs> <laughs> uh, This is priceless. <sighs> One for the money, two for the throw show, three to get ready. Four to say no. Wanna borrow my portable RAM? Get a plus one? You know, yeah, I'll take your portable RAM. You still have that fucking thing? Yeah, I I'm not gonna throw it out. It's a good ram. Why would you get rid of it? 
<laughs> Use it. All right. I don't know. Cause I'm pathetically weak. I lone fierce this my portable ram. I thought we already had it. I thought we already used it after thing of main, mini item, whatever, who he wasn't. Well, yeah, but yeah I, I can't bag, put it back in the robe. I can put it in my bag. Oh, okay. Are you going to keep uh, trying to help, Aaron? <laughs> keep doing it. You're less likely to hurt yourself than me. Fine. Yeah. All right, let's see here. <sighs> Ooh, Aaron, let's see that. This is awesome. Okay, first is roll me a reflex save. No! A reflex save? Okay. Uh, I forgot I had that. Let's go look at the rules for how that works. Okay, let me just double check, make sure you're ready to do it. Yes, it is. And roll 28. Not a very good roll. The door uh, slams open, the one behind you slams closed. Um, first is you stumble into the next room, um, almost knocking over a pile of lab equipment. A pile of what? Lab equipment. Okay. Oh. But you managed to catch yourself at the last moment instead of um, falling and uh, landing amidst a pile of broken glass and metal. Yeah, that probably would not have ended very well. Tetanus! Yay! <laughs> More than tetanus. <laughs> we have successfully <laughs> crossbred <laughs> Ebola with the. We have successfully crossbred Ebola with the common cold. Why would we you added, do that? We added, some, we added some lupus in there just to have shits and giggles, too. I am not going to say it. It's never lupus. Fuck you. <laughs> it's never lupus. I never... I don't know that reference. It's, it's a house joke. And house MD. Had Brett ran into the table, I think you should have given Fierces the clap. <laughs> That's just mean. <laughs> Alrighty, let's see. This room, uh... Oh, you know what's really awkward, guys? Isn't there a book that comes to sexual tension and disease? Yeah. Remember how you're finding a block and tackle? Yeah. Just realized, totally have one. Yeah, but you were at the bottom of the pit. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I, I have pittance and rope, I just don't have enough rope, apparently. You were the, the one of the MPLEs. So this room is full of uh, extremely, extremely complex alchemical equipment. This is a magnitude uh, more complex than any laboratory you've ever seen. For this. I think I have a feeling about what the fucking buttons do. Also, there's I got a feeling. Woohoo! That tonight's gonna be a good night. Tonight's gonna be a good night. That tonight's gonna be a good, good night. It was a real cat. Oh my, my. Oh, Magic Dealer. I can't stop. Can't stop, won't stop. <sighs> it's like Pringles and Murder. You can't stop, it just won't. I thought it was, I thought it was Pringles and Masturbation. Yeah, Whoa! It's a horrible combination. What the fuck? <laughs> oh. say I have never it's, tried. It's an old SNL skit. Yeah. Oh, that's actually. Generally, I try to avoid sexual. Uh, actually, actually, that reminds me. Uh, I was watching uh, Adam Savage on YouTube, and uh, he he was talking about how Jamie doesn't really have, you know, much sense of humor or tells jokes that often. Love it. So that when he does. Everyone kind of stops and pays attention. Yeah. So he's, he's he's so they're all like like working there in the shop one day, and Jimmy goes, "Uh, I have a joke." <laughs> and and they all kind of stand there and listen. He says, "This guy goes to see his doctor, get you know, have his routine physical done." Doctor looks him over and says, "Dude," he, he says, "Look, you gotta stop masturbating." The guy says, "Why?" He says, "Because I'm trying to give you a physical." <laughs> <laughs> I'm loving. Uh. So, anyways, back to this game. We're in an alchemical lab that seems to have been smashed a, a bit. Uh, no, I think it's intact. Is it? Yeah. Can't it is intact. 
for this avoided slamming into the end of a table and knocking a whole bunch of shit over. I think that should not enter this room. You just at first it just has this look of awe on his face, like Heaven. Yeah. Huh. Just a, I just lost power for half a second. Y yeah, Yay, bro. Yeah, that uh, happened that happened to me earlier today. There is a uh no. doorway to the south. Right. I say imagine no, all the experiments dude, I, I can do in here. Out. You wanna go? Go. I hope my power goes out of work tonight. Then I have an excuse to just lock the door and do nothing. So, I don't know if this is gonna be relevant or not to you guys later, but. Um, Whoa! Whoa! So, to make sure that it's appropriately noted. Um, my cat just made the static of like hell in my ear, my earbuds. <laughs> appropriately noted thing. Yeah, that sure was a shock. You know, you know, Jackie, Jackie, oh, yeah, it might be a little bit complicated for you to get the chat log from this game. Yeah, I kind of gave up not getting the chat log today. Tim T. Timmy T. <sighs> oh. Yeah, let's see here. I'm, I'm but been, love, what do you want? I I've gave you love. Periodically, I've been periodically checking the uh, map tools page for any updates. And yeah, not really anything new has been posted in here. Last one was posted oh about three hours ago. Well, actually, two, two, yeah, two hours ago. Yeah. Side note: Congratulations, Jackie. You have the most uh, not extremely common name here. <laughs> oh. You mean anything over four letters? Let's see, we have a Tom, a Tim, a Matt, a Brett, and a Will. <laughs> and Jackie. Oh. It was a conveniently have to be the only female, too. I, oh, yeah. to be fair, Tim is my short name. It's not my full name. Timothy? Yep. You know, no? um, actually, that kind of reminds me of something. One of my uh, friends just had his first child today. Oh. Uh, okay. So, um, they named her... God Fre damn it. They named her Freya. Sweet. As that's... in Norse god. Yes. Yeah, that's great. I had that dark joke thread back in my head. So what did she taste like? Oh! oh. <sighs> I don't get it. Yeah, he had his first baby. What did she taste like? Oh. <laughs> that's so like... Oh, this is why funny. I don't have. Uh, apparently, apparently they're, at first, Thanks. at first they're going to go with an, with induced labor, and I guess that wasn't taking, so they eventually had to go and, uh, as a, uh, as he put it, uh, a forced eviction. With uh, a cesarean. Yep. That sucks. Yeah, he he had a very interesting sense of humor in the whole thing. Yeah. Congratulations. Like, like Freya, we're, we're like Freya, we're issuing you your eviction notice. To be repeated when you turn 18. Congratulations, you have a... Your friend's daughter can slay Macbeth. <laughs> oh my god, we're, we have a... Uh, hey, uh, Brett, what's your alchemy bonus? What's my alchemy bonus? Yeah. Uh, Plus like... <laughs> more, more than 20. Congratulations, you can make anything you want. This lab has equipment that you hadn't even imagined, um, but looking at it, you're like, "Oh, I can do so many horrible things with that." Wonderful world improvement. This is thing. literally for this is wet dream. I don't want to be anywhere near him if this is part of his wet dream. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. First, it's been giving me some kind of homoerotic feels and. If this is his wet dream in his lab, I just don't want to end up bent over his work desk. Hey, 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 hey uh, I was gonna say something. It's gonna be smart. It was gonna be, it's gonna be well, fabulous. Aaron already blew his load, so I'm not real worried about him coming. About him, uh. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> I told you I wasn't gonna let that go. 
I'm, I, wait, when did this happen? I don't remember. Oh god, earlier. Previous game. I'm, 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 I, sorry, I'm. <laughs> oh, right, 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 right. Bill Nye is gonna be on Dancing with the Stars. Yep, I heard. Why? Because Bill Nye is fucking awesome. He's going to use so their- Because Bill Nye's fly is fucking, don't you ever fucking re it. So what you guys doing, yo? I don't know, let's do some alchemy. Well, nah. Birth this, Mr. Wizard. It, did you know he never had a, a degree in science? <laughs> That's why he got kicked was out. Wizard. Not Dr. Wizard. <laughs> Don't you know anything? Well, let's go check out this other door. That'd be nice. Steve Carlsberg. Alrighty. So, is everybody entering the uh, science lab first? So, I, I guess so. Science. Today is a good day for science. That's kind of how I picture all of Firthus's ancestors. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're probably not wrong. With the occasional DD wizard. DD? What? I, I, I don't want to even know. So, how do, and so uh, is that door locked? I'm waiting for people to actually enter the laboratory. Bill Nye the science guy. I can do this because I'm a bat. I tell you what though, one science guy I've been taking into listening and watching a lot of lately has been uh, Neil Tyson. Yeah, I was waiting for you to say it. Everyone listens to Neil Tyson. Now, I, I was watching a documentary with um, Michi Okaku. Is everybody in that's going in? All shores going ashore. Trinity, thank you. Because, you know, we're getting an awful lot of sidetrack today. Yeah. R. Sorry, I was AFK, actually. So. I had dinner. But I don't necessarily mean that. I just mean in general. we got lots of sidetrack stuff going on. There is. Which is fine if that's what we want to kind of do today. I kind of want to continue. Because I want to see Let's what happens. All right. Let's try the door. All right. Let's try opening up the door. The door is stuck. I'm beginning to sense a theme here. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I I want to try something before we you know waste a couple of rolls on that. Can we shut the other door? Are you gonna try? I'm a bat. I really can't. Can someone who has opposable thumbs try it? <laughs> uh, Aaron, you're closer. Do you really want me to try to shut the door? Yeah. Yeah. Fine, I try to shut the door. The door swings closed easily. There. Problem solved. Uh, okay, now I'm gonna open up this door. Okay, the door opens. Hey! <laughs> hey, it's you. just simple things, you know. <laughs> <laughs> there is another hallway. Mm -hmm. Emmy! Is there, uh, that's not Emmy. Emmy, that's Ruby. Ruby! Second it's verse, same as the first. <laughs> standard length of, uh, and uh, red buttons included, just like the other boys. <sighs> I think we're going around in a circle, guys. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. What made you figure that out, Sherlock? That. Well, shit.